A unique book signing event was held Friday at Kona Oceanfront Gallery and Saturday at the Royal Kona Resort's Don the Beachcomber Bar. The book signing was great. There was uh, a lot of folks, a lot of people, and uh, the um, gallery really looked beautiful. Hawaii is a great place to put mystery and get involved with uh, fantasy. Author S.P. Grogan and local artist Brad Tiki Shark Parker are promoting their second novel entitled Atomic Dreams at the Red Tiki Lounge. They say my artwork gets people in the gallery but uh, for the event they put it all around the stage inside so when I sat there uh, signing books you know people would see all my artwork behind me so that was that was really nice. Uh, we are the very fortunate beneficiaries of this event from both the book signing so all the books sold we'll get the proceeds from so the food basket is just absolutely delighted and honored by this. Las Vegas-based author Grogan used existing works by Kona-based artist Parker to illustrate the mystery thriller set in 1946 Honolulu. I found uh, Brad's painting in one of the in-flight magazines coming over to uh, Hawaii and I used it in my first book which, which was Captain Cooked which was published in 2011 and that won an award from the Hawaiian Publishers Association so I decided that maybe I could use Brad's work and illustrate a novel I had in mind, and that is what became Atomic Dreams at the Red Tiki Lounge. Well, I did the cover. Uh, it's not a graphic novel, but it's heavily illustrated. We were going to do um, several different plans of how we were going to illustrate the book, if we were going to do specific paintings and illustrations for story points, but other projects came up and S.P. Grogan was, uh, he's such a prolific writer and he was so in the, in the moment and, in, and flowing on his projects, he just took my paintings and started to run them together and made them the story points and I didn't have to paint them, they were already there. He was seeing the story kind of emerge out of the paintings. So uh, what happens uh, after we, he had the major paintings picked out, I went in and I did some spot illustrations, black and white illustrations of key characters in some key moments. Parker calls it Tiki Noir. The idea is I'm taking Hawaiiana, which is seen as a uh, 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 kitschy, uh, lowbrow artwork, and I'm doing it in a way to, to try to make it high artwork. Um, I wanted to do something that was not just an art book, but that could be seen as a book that you'd buy in a tour shop. So it would be like a novel you could read at the beach, not just an art book. So that kind of flowed into it. So uh, I, I started talking to S.P. Grogan because he had just written a tourist novel, definitely something you would read at the beach, and it was all about the Big Island. And uh, I, had, I, had, I talked to him, uh, he used my cover on the artwork of, uh, for the artwork for that. He had a really good response uh, from having my artwork on the cover of that book. So he said, would you like to work together again on anything? I said, yeah, I want to do an art book, but I would like to have a story with it so people could read it on the beach during their vacation. So that kind of turned into this, this novel idea. And uh, originally there was going to be a lot more artwork and a little bit of story, but he's such a great storyteller, it turned into more story and a little less artwork. And so it, it kind of, it was an evolving organic process. Well, because I've been coming over here for the last 10 years on vacation, and I find the motif, the plotting, and the atmosphere to be very exciting. Entertainment was provided by teen ukulele sensation Aiden James. Uh, when I was in D.C. to do an event, I met Brad at the event that I was performing at, and uh, his art was so unique, I haven't seen anything like it before. I think I saw it like in stores, his art though. I haven't seen anything else like it. It's just so unique and he paints like the weirdest stuff, but it's so awesome. They contacted me for this event. They contacted me for two of the events, which was yesterday we did at the gallery and then today we have an event out here at the Royal Corner Resort. Thank you very much. Aiden sounded amazing. The acoustics were perfect and it was fun. It was really good.